Your Excellency, I know our police force has been vilified for the actions that they have had to take to ensure that there is peace and our country, law and order thrives. But I want to encourage you that the task force, Your Excellency, that you appointed to look into the welfare of our officers, to hasten in the work that they are doing so that our police officers in this country are well taken care of. Well taken care of as well as they took care of the lives and property of Kenyans during these last three days when those who are engaging in subversive activities uh, tried to interfere with the peace and law and order of our country, Your Excellency. Your Excellency, let me also take this opportunity to ask those investigative agencies that are in charge of investigations. And I know even those of us in the fourth estate, we are very quick to vilify our police officers. But we fail to recognize that there are criminal elements that have taken advantage of the demonstrations that were called by those in the opposition. And we have seen even armed groups engaging our police officers with arms. Honorable Your Excellency, Mr. President, the day before yesterday in Kangemi, there was a group that fired at police officers. And we are lost at what the police are expected to do when criminals using firearms are firing at police officers in the disguise of demonstrations. Our police officers must be firm to maintain law and order and we must continue encouraging them. 